Hello folks, welcome to my YouTube channel. Uh, I'm sorry that I didn't get in here yesterday, folks. I went to church, and I was tired, and we were busy all day. We had to go to town and things like that. Hello, folks. I hope you're doing well. Uh, we have a low humidity day, folks, so we'll probably be doing the birds here not too long from now. And, um... I just wanted to get in here and show you Garfield and say hello to you folks. But, um, you know, uh, I'm doing okay, and I hope y'all are doing okay. You still working on your mind therapy, folks? For those of you uh, that's been with narcissists or whatever, folks, uh, you want to keep working on your mind therapy, folks, and move on and try to help yourself, you know, get through these bad situations. But uh, I just wanted to get in here and talk to y'all. You know, I didn't get to see y'all day yesterday. And I guess you all thought I left, but I didn't. Uh, it just that some days, folks, it gets so busy, it's hard to get in here all the time. And I wanted to show you Garfield. My husband said he thought that was pretty neat, folks. But I've been drawing uh, cartoon characters and stuff, folks, you know, challenging myself to see how good I do with them. And I'm hoping that you guys enjoy this, too. But, um, yeah, folks, I went to church yesterday, and I had a pretty good day at church, folks, and I'm hoping that you guys did, too, uh, because it's good for you, and it's good for your soul, folks, and also... Church, going to church is a good uplifter too, folks. Uh, because, you know, reading the Bible, reading the scripture or something like that's good for you, folks. That's good for depression as well. And it's a beautiful day, folks. It's low humidity outside. And it's going to be a good day to get out there and work with the birds, you know. And uh, maybe possibly drain the pools out and things. But uh, i just been sitting around drawing pictures, folks. And I went ahead and colored that Garfield guy. Because he was only um, basically three colors. Black, yellow, and uh, orange. So I just went ahead and colored him. Because I thought you guys would enjoy this. And um, if you want to, folks, you can leave me a reply in the reply box and let me know how I did on that picture. And I'll be drawing more pictures. We'll be going out to see the birds more often, folks. And we'll be doing different things. And probably sometime this week, I'm going to wind up taking all them rocks that I had and putting them out there by the front chicken pen, you know, because I got three baggies full, folks. I didn't really realize I had that many rocks. I didn't think I painted that many, but I gathered them all up, and I've got them all three sitting in a baggie here, and I might uh, wind up taking them out there sometime this evening, you know, because it's probably going to be even cooler out there this evening. But uh, me and my husband's going to try to get out and enjoy the fresh air and stuff, folks, while we got the chance. Because tomorrow's going to be a real hot day. And it'll be another day that you'll have to sit in all day and, you know, um, not be able to get out in the heat because of heat stroke and things, folks. But hello. Stay cheerful, folks. Keep trying to work on getting into things that helps your mind therapy, folks. And doing all your self-talk and everything. 
And uh, I know you guys probably thought I left the country yesterday, but I didn't go anywhere. I've been here the whole time, folks. It's just on Sundays it gets real busy, folks. Because like I told you, when me and my husband go out, we try to make our trips count because of the gas prices. And, um, you know, get all of our groceries in for the week. And uh, sometimes I get to the point where I get overwhelmed and I have to sit and relax and stuff, you know, and get me a little bit of rest and unwind. Because yesterday, folks, uh, I was tired at church and uh, I knew that I was probably going to come home and relax and maybe possibly go to bed early, which is what I did, folks. Uh, you know, because sometimes if we don't sleep good, we have to try to grab a, a nap every time we get the chance, folks. But I hope you all are doing okay with everything, folks, and um, enjoying all the videos that I got on here. I try to make them as enjoyable as possible, folks. But what we will get in and do the birds a little bit more. And, um, you know, let you all see the little chick and things like that. Because I'll probably go down there sometime this evening. And um, I like outdoors, folks. I like to go out and enjoy myself. But, you know, we've been battling with these hornets. And I was going to tell you all um, the other night. I think it was uh, Saturday night. Those hornets, for some apparent reason, they decided to swarm around the house. And that's what I'm talking about, folks. You know, that when they swarm like that, it could be uh, when you're outside, you know. And that's very dangerous because usually when they swarm like that, you could get stung uh, several times by them. And that's why I say they're dangerous, folks. And that's why it's very important not to have them living around your house. And, uh, yeah, you have to, if you spot them on your property, you know, you if, even if you see one or two of them, folks, that's probably an indication that you got a nest around close to you. And also another sign that you'll know that you got hornets on your property is they will uh, gather wood off of a wooden privacy fence or a deck or anything, folks, because there's marks all over the place around here where they've been using uh, the wood to make their nests with. But um, you just have to be careful, folks, because those are very dangerous um, insects, and you don't want them living around your property or anything. But uh, anyway, folks, I wanted to get in here and say hello to you, and I hope your day goes well, and I hope you have a blessed day, folks. And we'll probably be coloring some more pictures and everything, folks, together. And, uh, you know, doing just anything, folks. The rocks, I have to kind of calm down on them because, like I said, I have to take them out and put them out by the chicken pen because I got so many of them. And uh, if I ever come up and find me some more uh, flat rocks, you know, close to like slate rock type, you know, I would like to get some more of them because if you get the bigger ones, folks, you can paint some real pretty pictures on them and make them look nice and everything. But folks, this is the relaxation channel and I hope you guys have a uh, nice day enjoying the videos. Thank you, and we will get in here and um, do some more bird videos for you folks. And that will probably be as soon as today, folks. Um, you know, because I have to get out there and redrain the goose's pool and 
go down there and uh, feed the little chick and water them. So, yeah, we'll get in here sometime today and do that, folks. Well, thank you, folks. I hope you have a nice day and a blessed day, too. You got this, folks. You're awesome. Bye-bye. Bye, folks.